hello friends and welcome to my twitch um and for the vod that i might i'll probably upload to youtube as well welcome welcome to my youtube channel welcome to my twitch wherever you end up watching this um welcome i am very very excited to be playing this game so this is a game that i had done um, I knew about f from a long time back. Uh, there's, there's a bit of a story with this one. I have not played it. I've avoided spoilers so far. Um, but basically, the I, I'll, I'll start out the uh, the story. <laughs> um, normally, I, I was planning on uh, playing this one day on my channel directly and having um, episodes like that. I wasn't initially planning on streaming this, but um, the creator of the game, Laura Shigahara, um, I, again, I, if I mispronounce any of this, this if I mispronounce Rakwin, Rakwin, I don't know how to pronounce them exactly, I've only seen them written, I haven't gotten a chance to see her, her streams or anything, um, so I apologize, <laughs> despite being a fan and despite th these things being important to me, I still don't know how to pronounce them exactly, <laughs> um, but basically, uh, this is the fifth anniversary of the game, and um, for it, the celebration, she has a whole thing where she's getting some other indie developers, and she was doing interviews, and she wanted to, she, she wanted some more folks to be able to stream the game in celebration, to really like help promote it and have a whole a whole shindig. Uh, it's even being released on the Switch as well, which is really cool. It's it's all a really cool time. And, um, she had, uh, she was gonna offer a few Steam keys to whoever wanted to stream it during the time, and, uh, I had, I had asked for it, and she had given me one, so this, this game is actually provided by Laura herself, which is really, really cool. Um, the story behind this one, a little bit, is, um, a long time, uh, back, almost... Let me see, I think it's about eight years now. <laughs> um, back when my mom had, um, I, I, won't, I won't go into the full story here, it's, it's kind of personal. Um, but basically the long and, and short of it is that when my mom had been uh, sick with cancer, and when she had um, died, I had played a lot of Plants vs. Zombies at the time, um, and it really helped me get through a very... A, a rougher point in my life over over at that point, and I remember there were times when I'd be very sad and very depressed, and basically, I just went to Laura Shigahara's band camp, where she had the full soundtrack, which has the cute little, like, thing with the little um, ice, uh, snow pea playing on the trumpet, and the other ones have the little instruments, there's a little, that's what the little soundtrack looked like, so I went over to her band camp, and I would just listen to the soundtrack a whole bunch while I was really sad. And um, at that point, Rakuin hadn't come out yet, so it was just, oh, look, look at this, um, Rakuin is going to come out, and it's going to be, it's, it's a game that she's working on, it looked really cool, and it was like, oh, man, that's so cool. And every time I went over to the site, I saw on her band camp, oh, look, she's working on, on this game, that's really neat, um, I, I want to play it someday. And, well, time, fly, time flies, and <laughs> the game's been out for five years now, and I never got a chance to uh, get or play it. So, now I have the opportunity, and a lot of the time when I, a lot of the times when I play um, <laughs> a lot of the games on my channel, I'm either super extra chill, uh, and super into the game and excited, or I'm super dumb and silly and stupid when playing it, or a mix of the two. Um, I'll definitely have a few moments where I'll be silly, but I really want to take this game a bit more seriously, uh, hence the very long introduction to <laughs> this prefacing everything. I hope I'm not puffing, I'm not puffing into the microphone too much because this is, uh, this is a bit different than what I normally do when I record where I have my phone audio, which my phone is actually the best microphone I have. Um, and, uh, blah, 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 blah. come on, brain. Um, 
normally the audio quality sounds better because I'm using it through my my phone and I sync up the audio and stuff like that. Uh, it's it's not it's not as common for me to use this microphone. Actually, I'm gonna if I turn it like this, nobody's here to give me feedback. But um, maybe this is a little this is okay. I'm adjusting the little puff guard. I really don't know how this sounds. I really wanted to do something a bit more special for this um, and make it sound a little bit better. <laughs> so I really hope that it, I don't mess up all the audio and it just sounds awful and everything. There's a lot of extra background noise and garbage and I, I don't know how it sounds. I'm not going to know until I see the VOD back and then I cringe at how terribly it'll sound. <laughs> um, but I'm going to hope that it'll be okay. <laughs> Because I really wanna, I really wanna give this game its its due credit and, and and have it be a proper experience for folks to enjoy. But I think streaming it during the celebration is a proper way of being cool. My brain isn't working. Um, I, I think this is special enough, uh, flaws and all. So let's let's give it a shot. I know where this is. This is a long intro, but I wanted to. I wanted to preface it. I don't fully know what the game is about either, because I've, I've avoided spoilers for it this whole time. All I know is it's going to be a super emotional game, and it's going to have all sorts of themes about being kind, and also the kid is sick, and I think the mom is nice, which is funny because, you know, that's the opposite of this, this is my, my real life situation. So let's give it a shot. The new story. This is a little book. I love the way that it, it looks. It, it's all... In, indented into the little um, the little leather book jacket. The art direction on this looks really cool. <laughs> and you can either do a new story, resume, or close the book. There's no options menu, but that is fine. <laughs> new story. New story. Oh, it glows! Oh yes, the intro music was very lovely. Controls! Okay. Um, arrow keys, not the number pad. Move around. Space or enter. Confirm, interact with the people, examine objects. Escape is cancel or the menu. Um, the quest journal items and save. Talk with mom when she's with you is Q. Okay, so the menu is escape and Q is the mom button. Good to know. Here we go. Oh, he's sick. Child, no. Uh oh. Oh, the game froze. Oh, there we go. He's awake. Oh, I like that the little thing was was blue for a moment. Yeah, look at that. It was blue, and now it's a different color. It's boy. Hello, boy. Look at you with your cute little hat. Oh, it's made of paper. What voice should I do for the boy? What, what's a boy voice? Um, hmm, let's see. Oh, I should have figured these out ahead of time. Um, hmm, uh, who, who's there? Back to sleep, boy goes. Oh. Aha! Person! It's Yami! Hello, Yami! Are you Yami Yugi? Hey! A long stare. How'd you get in here? Your door's unlocked, man. <laughs> oh. Who are you? I'm Yami. I live across the hall. Did you just move in or something? No, I think I got here the, around the same time as you. But they never let me out of my room. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry. Eh, it's okay. I sneak out at night when the nurses aren't watching. Yeah. Promise you won't tell anybody I'm here, okay? I promise. 
So, how long are you in here for? I don't know. Mom says it could be a while. Same here. It gets really boring sometimes. I know what you mean. Oh, someone's coming. Sorry, man. I gotta go. Wait, if they're coming, don't go out the door. I thought he was gonna hide. Hey, hey wait! Yeah? Maybe I could visit you sometime. It's not as boring when there's two. You won't be able to get into my room. I'm not even supposed to leave, remember? Oh, yeah. Don't worry. I'll come visit you again. I promise. Yummy? Where'd you go? Out the door. I like that it fades to color when the thing goes out. Arrow keys! Okay, definitely not WASD. It has to be the arrow keys. Oh! Here we go. It's boy time. I can pick up the phone. I love that. I love the little animation there. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, that's a nice touch. A house plant that looks like it could use some water. An IV bag filled with saline solution. We Open the cabinet. Yes. Cabinet's empty. Open the door. Get on the floor. <gasps> the, the door is locked. There's a sign on the door. Read it? Yeah, sure. Storage area 5B. Patient's not allowed beyond this point. Oh. An origami hat. Oh. Treatment guide. Patient number 237. I, I like how they don't say the treatment specifically what he has. A pimp. Oh, okay. It's, it's just a pile of things. Door. Oh, it's the bathroom. Oh, I can turn on the light. Oh, I like that. I like the effect. That's cool. Fill the sink with water? No. Fill the sink with water. Yes. Look at it go. Sink is filled with water. A mirror. Toilet. Oh, there we go. Now it's open. Hello, hello. Oh, it's the mom. Hello, dear. It's mom. Is that the voice that I want for her? Yeah. Mom. Just want to let you know that my train was delayed. So I'm going to be a little bit late. Oh. Okay. I'm so sorry, dear. I'm going as fast as I can. It's okay, Mom. I understand. But I'm off to work this week, and I dropped off your little brother at Grandma's. So, we'll be able to spend lots of time together. We can play games. I'll read to you. It'll be like our own little party. Thanks, Mom. I love you. I love you, too. Ooh, a light. <gasps> Nurse lady. <gasps> Doctor! Doctor lady. Well, well. I see you wide awake and walking around. No, no one told me I couldn't walk around. 
Okay, wise guy. I've got a couple of things to tell you. First of all, some good news. Your tests have come back, and it turns out things are looking pretty good. In fact, I think it might be okay for you to walk around the halls a bit today. You mean... I get to leave my room? Indeed. Yes! Not so fast. There's something else I need to talk to you about. This morning, the cafeteria reported that a lot of food and drink was stolen from the kitchen. Since the wing was all locked up last night, we believe the thief might still be in the building somewhere. So can you take a moment to just check and see if any of your belongings were stolen? Okay. Oh, there's the light. Oh no! It's gone! Doctor, they took it! They took- Oh no! They took Raquin! What did they take? Raquin. It's my favorite book in the whole world. My mom reads it to me every night. It's very special. Are you completely sure you uh, you didn't just misplace it? I'm sure. After mom finishes reading, she always puts it back in the same place. It's our tradition. Okay, calm down. What did your book look like? Uh, it has a brown cover. Looks very old. And there's a clasp made of silver with a hole for the key. Silver clasp, eh? I guess that explains why they'd take a children's storybook. Well, I'm really sorry about this. I can only imagine how important it must have been to you. I want you to know that we'll be doing all we can to track down the thief. Mom's gonna be so sad. Hmm. You know what? What? Since you're allowed to leave your room today, why don't you go talk to some of the other folks around the floor? Who knows? Maybe someone will be able to help you get your book back. Take care now. I'll be back to check on you in a bit. Yes. Oh, it's the whole building. Ah. Oh. Here we go. Oh, I want to check. Boys' room. Here we are. Tony's room. Oh, it's Tony. Check it, Tony's book. Book about airplanes. Plant. A broken music box. If you touch that music box, I'll break your hands. <laughs> <laughs> You break the box, you break the hand. A hand for a box, a box for a hand. Treatment guide. Patient number 196, blood samples. Uh, you're the, the Mr. Nurse guy. There's no point in talking to Tony before he's had his coffee. He'll just growl at you like a big angry bear. I heard that, you little brat. Ooh, that rhymed. See what I mean? IV drip. IV bag filled with a saline solution. Ooh, you, we, we're on the same stuff. What the heck do you think you're doing in my room, kid? Get out! It figures when I want visitors, no one shows up. When I need peace and quiet, every idiot in the world has to come to my room. And where is that nurse with my coffee? Yeah. The door is locked, can't go to the bathroom, can't go to the old man's bathroom, no. Hospital admittance form number two. Eh. Hello. Hi, doctor. I heard you had a pretty tough day today. You hang in there, alright? You're doing great. Can I talk to...
to person back here. No. Ooh, open the cabinet? Yeah. Folders filled with medical forms. Medical folders. Looks like there's something beneath the folders. <gasps> Look underneath. Yes. I found five gold. I just robbed a hospital. <laughs> I robbed a hospital today, Mom. <laughs> Aren't you proud of me? <laughs> the door is locked. Look at the sign. Look at the knob. Here's an electronic device with a passcode entry labeled Closet 5C. However, it doesn't appear to be turned on. Look at the sign. Keep out. Only authorized personnel allowed beyond this point. Okay. Wheeled chair. Chair of wheels. Can't sit in there. <gasps> Painting. It's Cora. Hi there. What's up, Cora? Legend of Cora. Hey, I don't think we've formally met. I'm Cora. It's probably pretty easy to remember me, because I'm the only girl in my grade with a pink mohawk. Whoa, cool. And don't worry, my mom knows. <laughs> She's the one who let me do it. Anyways, it was nice meeting you. Nice meeting you too, Cora. Oh, hey, some friends and I are working together to do something special for the people on our floor here in the hospital. Like what? I'll have more details later, but if you find anything cool you'd want to donate, come talk to me. Okay. I know a lot of folks feel powerless when they have to stay here. But here's the way I see it. No one knows how much time they have in this world. My time could be up in 80 years. Or eight minutes. Uh. Point is, I'm going to do everything I can to make good use of my time. Time's precious, you know. If I could help just one person here to feel happier, then it'd be all worth it. Hmm. Hey there. Did you hear about the thief? Dude, yeah. Chef Panky came out here earlier and he was not happy. I guess the thief took a lot of food from the cafeteria kitchen. How the heck did they get into the kitchen? I think the ketchup, the kitchen. I can't even get in there from the cafeteria. Oh, you can't even get there from the cafeteria. Believe me, I've tried. <laughs> hey there. Oh, something I like to look for spare. Sometimes I like to look for spare change around the hospital. You'd be surprised how much is just laying around in cabinets and drawers. Did you hear about the thief? Oh yeah, it's just the same stuff. Tell me about the folks here. Who do you want to know about? Tony. Just between you and me, I think Tony's hiding something. The book, perhaps? He acts so grumpy all the time, but he's got this pretty little music box in his room that he guards with his life. Why would a grumpy old dude like that have a sweet little music box? Oh, that. Who do you want to know about? Sue. Sue's a sweetheart, but she's obsessed. Obsessed? Yeah, I guess she had to move to the hospital before saying goodbye to her friend. That's pretty much all she talks about now. What do you want to know about Jackie? Jackie's that guy over at the blood drawer station. He's cool. A little weird, but cool. If you ever need to know about anything technical, he's the guy to ask. What do you want to know about? Never mind. The pink cat? Oh, it's Jackie. He has a little, uh, little, little bear. A little bear hair. Hello, small child. What brings you to my blood draw station? <laughs> I'm making him Markiplier. Interested in learning about the circulatory system, platelets, and perpetual motion machines? Oh, his eyes were, were very happy about that. <laughs> what can I help you with? What's up? Sometimes I like to contemplate things like, why are there only two egg-laying mammals in the world? I'm sure many species could benefit from laying eggs. But so far, only the platypus and echidna families have hopped on that bandwagon. Why, if I could lay eggs, I would be laying eggs all the time. 
is so happy about the prospect of laying eggs. Eh. What can I help you with? In a world with so many new things to learn, no one needs to be bored. For example, did you know that a neutron star is so dense that a teaspoon of its matter would weigh more than all the people on Earth? I don't know what that means. One day you will. <laughs> if you live, bum, 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 bum. then it'll blow your mind. Hey. What can I help you with? What's that? Oh, okay. He, he says the same stuff. No, no, no. One more. Come on. There we go. Okay, did you hear about the thief? Come here. I'll let you in a little secret. Are you the thief? Have you noticed anything strange about this hospital? Not really. Eh. Uh, not really. Oh. <laughs> A while back, I started noting cryptic little message, noticing cryptic little messages written all over the place. And last night, I saw someone go into that closet south of Tony's room, but... I was told that closet has been locked since before I started working here. I'm pretty sure they were not staff. What did they look like? I only saw them out of the corner of my eye, and for but a second... So unfortunately, I could not say. What can I help you with? Tell me about the folks here. What do you want to know? Panky. It's the Panky, Hanky Panky. The children love Hanky Panky. If he notices someone having a bad day, he'll give him ice cream. Aww. I knew a guy who was like that at my, um, my grandma's assisted living home. Ice cream. Using the scientific secret of salt to lower the freezing poison of ice in order to melt to freeze the cream. Genius. Who would you like to know about? Kisaboro. I knew Kisaboro back before his mind started going. We spoke often. It's sad to see someone's mental condition deteriorate like that. What do you mean? Well, for example... Recently, the staff found him outside, digging in the mud again. He was on his hands and knees, making piles of mud using spoons he got from the kitchen. Oh, man. But hey, maybe he knows something we don't. Maybe he was looking for... Buried treasure? Buried treasure! Eh. Yeah. Who would you like to know about? Danielle. Danielle is the purple-haired girl who hangs out in the cafeteria. She sews the most marvelous plushies for all the patients here. Who would you like to know about? Okay, see you later. No, get back here. Hello, my blood child. How can I help you? Oh, wait, no, that was it. Yeah, I gotta go. Blood station, more than meets the eye. I'm behind the curtain. Oh! I am ghost child. I phase through the curtains. You can't see me. Now you can see me. And there I go. I, oh! Nurse, did you call me? Oh, I like how the little text box is over the, over the nurse. Shift leader. Yeah. Apparently the toilet in Sue's room is broken now. Can you do anything about it? I'm a nurse, not a plumber. I don't even know how to fix a toilet. Well, someone has to do it. You know we're short-staffed. Will the child have to fix the toilet? Fine, I'll go see if I can dig up some supplies. Oh, okay. Thank goodness. Ooh. Device used to measure height. Dev device used to measure weight. Hospital scale. Okay. Mm, can't get to the back. L woman in way. Shift leader. Quit, bug Quit bugging me, kid. I've got a lot to do right now. And my stomach's growling. What I wouldn't give for a peanut choo-choo. <gasps> it's a peanut choo-choo. It's the choo-choo. Oh, I love repeated words. Yay. It's the choo-choo. It's like the choo jellies from Zelda. Oh, doctor person. Now, where did I put that MD? I mean, key. I must have dropped it somewhere. <laughs> Colorful paper, uh, a color, oh, oh, no, 
colorful paper flyer. Yes. Towel Cape Heroes, a group of fun-loving volunteers and patients working together to make the hospital a better place for everyone. Oh, that's nice. I'm in the bed. I am in the bed. Now I'm not in the bed. No longer in the bed. Open the locker? Yes. Find a pair of scrubs hanging inside. Do I get... Can I keep the scrubs? I'll open the locker. Rusted shut. Okay. Peanut choo-choo from here? Semi-functional vending machine. <laughs> what would you like to buy? Peanut choo-choo's 10, 10 grams. No. Coffee restocking soon. No. Please deposit 10G. Coffee. Oh, wait. Uh, hold on. There's a thingy. The hot coffee will be restocked soon, as soon as our shipments arrive. Shift leader. Oh, that's why he didn't get his coffee. Cafeteria. Leave the hospital. Oh! Okay. I'm out. Open the locker. Yes. Doors rusted shut. This is a big child. Those are tiny seats. Ah, hospital staff. New patient lounge is still being built. Please come back later. Mm, blocking the way. Leave the hospital. Oh no, this is the this is going further into the hospital. Oh, you're the plushy lady. One of your plushies has, has become alive. Living plushie. <gasps> meow meow. It's Chef Hanky Panky. I told you. You're not supposed you're not supposed to have a cat in the hospital. Oh, Danielle. It's fine. She's a seeing eye cat. My vision is really bad. Get out of here, Danielle. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Thank you's the worst. Meow meow. Woof woof. Freshly made plushies. Mmm. Nice and fresh. Broom. Boxes. Magazines, notebooks, and other paper materials can be found here. No stuff. Okay, same thing here. Various drinks, yogurt, and fruit cups line the shelves. Rice bowls and snacks. The top shelf you see an assortment of onigiri. Ah. Oh. I think that's the the rice balls, which were called the jelly donuts famously in Pokemon. Let's see. This bin is filled with ice cream and other frozen snacks. Yay! All right, Danielle. Hey, kiddo. Need something? What's up? I just finished up a patch of plushies. My goal is to make one for all the patients on the floor, even old cranky men like Tony and Panky. Hey, I heard of that. Good. Hey, kiddo. You need something? Let's see. Don't tell anyone I told you this, but you know how some of the doors around here have those electronic lockbox things on them? I heard that they keep the password somewhere behind the reception desk that's across from Kisaburu's room. What do you think is beyond those doors? You mean, you haven't been there before? What? No, of course not. I'm just a volunteer. Hey, kiddo, you need something? Tell me about the folks here, volunteer. Winston! Winston tastes good like a Winston should. Have you noticed? Winston's wife doesn't have her wedding band on. Don't you think that's a little strange? I mean, Winston is still wearing his. Oh, I know all about the people here. Tony? I know Tony seems like the biggest grump on the planet, but I can tell you that he's just a bit lonely. I bet if you brought him some coffee, he'd open up to you a bit. Oh, I know all the people here. Sue. She didn't used to be so poor, but I heard that her father drank a bit too much and then gambled away all their savings. Oh, I know all the people around here. Hey, kiddo, what's up? You like cats? Love them. Aren't they the best? I have like four of them at home. If all goes well, I'll have lucky number five by the end of the year. Hey, kiddo, need something? What's up? You like, you like jazz? You know. <laughs> she explodes. Get out of 
my side! Hey kiddo, you need something? What's up? <laughs> you like cats? No. <laughs> What's up? No. Then heal you, self destruct. Did no damage, cause self destruct never does. Woman person lady kitchen staff. Sorry, hun. You know you're not supposed to be leaving this wing. ATM? Insert credit or debit card. Surcharges may apply. Not the surcharges! No! Fresh Odin. Mmm, Odin. Caution, these drinks are hot. Panky Panky? Hey there! A long time I no see, buddy. Are you a hungry? You need a something? What's up? Did you hear that they finally stocked the vending machines out in the hospital hall or with the, the peanut to choo choos? The shift leader was in here the other day, begging us to do it. <laughs> oh, excuse me. I guess it's not of the kids that like them, eh? You need a something. I used to work for a big fancy restaurant. Oh my gosh, that's also what happened with the guy who, who's at my grandma's nursing home. <laughs> Uh, not nursing home. The, the, the nursing home was second. The, before it was the assisted living home. Um, pay it was a good, but I didn't really enjoy it. You need a something? Yeah, did you hear about the thief? Oh yeah, someone came in here and took a bunch of food and drinks. And no way they got in here before the cafeteria. See that middle door up there? It comes down after hours and no one can get through that. So I bet they somehow got into the backspace. Like the button, the backspace. Yeah, it's a network of a closed off passageways, half built rooms, storage closets, you know. It's odd for a hospital to have, I, okay. Uh, the aftermath of, uh, well, yeah, it's a crazy back there. Okay, it'll be explained. You need a something? Tell me about the folks here. Or do you want to a no? Danielle. Don't tell her I said this, but Danielle's got a heart of a gold. She spends her free time coming in here and sewing toys for all of the patients. And really don't tell her I said this. She's a bit of a crazy cat lady. <laughs> and that... Ooh, I got, and I got a thing in my Steam inventory for that. Hey, what can I say? It's a true. Yeah, it is. <laughs> what do you want to know about? Kesaboru. I thought the Kesaboru comes here one more time borrowing of my stuff. I swear. Borrowing? Oh, yeah. He took all of my soup ladles. And for what? To go digging in the mud to look for some buried treasure. I feel bad for the guy, though. It's never easy when one starts losing their mind like that. Must be even a tougher for his family. Oh, that, that's not as whimsical. Oh, hey, who do you want to know? Jackie. Jackie's a smart guy. Sometimes I think he's on another planet, but if there's a one thing we can talk about, it's a food. Of course, we have a different methods. He's all a science and he cooks with his brain. I cook with my heart. Oh my gosh, he's actually... <laughs> that was actually the thing he was about to say. I cook with my heart. What do you want to know? I swear I haven't played this game before. Shopping cart. Cook with the heart. Cook with the cart. No, nothing else. Okay. Yeah. And away we go. Leave the room. Yes, it's you. As your detective, we're coming along. Find any good leads? Nope. Open the locker. Yes. Lab coat and a pair of scrubs are hanging inside. Looks like there's something beneath the lab coat. Money? Look underneath. Yes. Found gold. Yeah. Okay. Open the locker, yes. A pair of scrubs hanging inside. Open the locker, yes. Okay, no, it's just, it's just scrubs. Oh, it's it's another height and weight machine. Cool. Ah, nifty. Alright. Unfortunately, he's not able to run. But that's for atmospheric purposes. Running will kind of mess with that. Room. Hey, what are you doing? Uh, yeah. This is a girl's room, you know. If you really gotta use the bathroom, come talk to me. 
toilet here is broken. Some some metal thing is stuck inside. If you go in, you should probably find a different bathroom. Oh, if you have to go, you should probably find a different bathroom. Hey, I thought I told you. If you want to use the bathroom, you gotta come talk to me first. Sorry. <gasps> dying woman. Not dying person. It's Winston! What's up? Oh, how you doing today? What's up? My wife's been asleep for months now. Oh, coma. But I still talk with her every day. Sometimes I read to her. That stuff really helps, you know. Futurama was not an exaggeration. That stuff really that stuff really actually helps people in comas. They actually can hear that stuff. It's, it's actually important to do that. How are you doing today? I heard you create an entire set of armor out of paper. Aww. That's quite impressive. Did you hear about the thief? Have you noticed that some of the doors around here have been electron have electronic passcode devices? I've been told that those areas have long been closed off, even to the staff. But recently I noticed that one of the devices had been turned on. How are you doing today? Tell me about the folks here. What would you like to learn about? Sue! On occasion, I've had to take Sue back to her room. She has a bit of a habit of walking around aimlessly on certain nights. What would you like to learn about? Tony! Everyone has something to say about Tony. I believe Tony hasn't talked with his family in a long time. Makes me sad to think that families can be torn apart just because some people don't see eye to eye on something. What would you like to, know, to learn about? Cora! I heard that Cora and her friends have been working on a special project to boost morale around the hospital. Last I heard, they were calling themselves the Towel Cape Heroes. Oh, they're the Towel Cape Heroes. Would you like to learn about? Never mind. Wake up. Oh. Wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up. Patient's blood samples. Picks up file, drinks it. <laughs> A thermometer. <laughs> Patient 138. Brain injury. State of coma. Respiration session. Oh. House plant looks like it could use some water. Everything in here could use some water. Wow. So many different marbles. Is this gonna be like Hook? Am I gonna have to find them? Oh. Yeah, I've been... Yeah, I've been collecting them for a long time. Marbles. So you want to use our bathroom, eh? <laughs> well, I guess. <laughs> oh, I should have come in here before I I checked the bathroom, so I should say something else. Yeah, I get it. We all gotta go sometimes. But I can't let just anyone use our bathroom. It is a girl's room, you know. Gosh, it looks like you really gotta go through. <laughs> well, how about this? See that jar next to me? Oh, the marbles? Yep. It's my marble collection. I haven't lost it. Oh, no, wait, I, uh, I did lose my marbles. I was carrying a bunch of them around in my pocket. I'm pretty sure some of them fell out. You could find me just one. I'll let you use our bathroom whenever you want. What a weird thing. You think you could do that for me? I'll try my best. Thank you. The last place I was playing was with Danielle in the cafeteria. So you might want to check around there. Okay, check the cafeteria to find the girls' lost marbles so that I can enter the girls' bathroom. I will say, this is not what I was expecting from the emotional story of Raquin. <laughs> but it's charming. Oh, this is a reverse shadow here? Oh, I guess there's a window and everything else is dark here? Huh. Do I have to check every tile? Pile of freshly made plushies. Looks like there's something underneath one of the toys! Check it out! Yes! Found a snowy marble! Haha! -ha. Now I can enter the child's bathroom. Oh. Is this something that I shouldn't be doing? I need to, I need to lie down. Alright, I'm good. Alright, child. Here's a marble for you. I wonder where my Pokemon marbles went. 
Any luck? Give Sue the snowy marble? No. Yes. The snowy marble. Oh, it's so cute. Ah. Uh oh, it froze. Uh oh, the game froze. Oh, the snowy marble was too much to handle. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh no. Oh no, the music stopped. <laughs> oh no. Oh, there we go. Ah, you found my snow world. Snow world? Shh. Can you keep a secret? Yes. These aren't just marbles, you know. They're little worlds. All of them are tiny planets. Aww. With tiny people living inside. That's why it's, why it's so important for me to find them all. This swirly white marble is a snow world. It's snowing all the time here. I know that might sound boring. But it's not. Real snowmen live here. Real snowmen live here. And they're always having parties. What kinds of parties? Snowman dance parties. I love dancing. Me too. Oh. They have pretty little lanterns everywhere too. And a blue campfire that feels cold. But if we went there, we wouldn't freeze. The snowman may have a magical drink that can keep a person warm. So we could dance with them and never get too cold. Aww. That sounds great. Thanks for helping me. I feel better now that they're back with me. My name's Sue. It's nice to meet another kid around here. Oh yeah, and feel free to use the bathroom any time you want. If you find any more of my marbles, you think you could bring them to me? Oh, 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 oh there we go. <sighs> of course. Thanks so much. Yay. All right. Too bad fixing toilets once it's on the curriculum at nursing school. Uh, okay. Oh. Oh, oh there, oh, there, there we go. Oh, oh no, it's frozen. It's frozen. You can't see it. I think on the playback it doesn't look like it's frozen. Uh, but it is. Oh, oh, there we go. Okay. Light. Light. Night. Ooh, blocked off room. Fill the sink with water, of course. Come on. Oh, I don't know why everything is starting to get kind of laggy. Here we go. What a cute little effect. It appears there's a tunnel running through here that's been blocked off. Pugsley's Tunnel? Perhaps you could go through this if you had the right tools. Huh. Hospital. Well, flush or leave it be. The Hospital Tunnel. <laughs> Interesting. I imagine that it's going to... A lot of these aren't actually real, and it's just the imaginations of the kids, like with the little snowy marbles. Um... It'd be kind of cool if it turns out it was real. Um, but apparently for real there's a hospital with, with tunnels? Unless this is all a dream itself. Who knows? Come on. Come on. Please just... Oh, okay. I'm gonna hit down. And I won't touch anything else. Because apparently everything is lagging. There we go. Now leave it be. Now flush. Toilet stock. Flush, yes! Will it overflow? Oh, there's a, there's a spot for a marble. Looks like there's something shiny floating inside. Take it. <laughs> Ew, gross. No. Yeah, it could be cool. I received the key to Tony's bathroom. Oh, it's what every child dreams of. Did I, did I fix it by flushing it? Wow. Yeah, that guy's really bad at fixing toilets. You didn't, you didn't try flushing it, really? Yep, I did it. I, the child, ended up having to fix the toilet. <laughs> Wait, you fixed the toilet? Thanks, kid. And I won't wash my hands. Excellent. Here, let me s <laughs> let me smear my hands all over the blood station table. There we go. <laughs> and away I go. I have the key to Tony's. Oh, let me move the mouse cursor away. Peanut choo-choo. Choo-choo yum-yum. 
semi-functioning vending. It's a peanut choo-choo. It's the peanut choo-choo. It's the chewiest of choo-choos. <gasps> Ooh, items. Yes, the peanut choo-choo. Oh, I should have checked the marble. Why would you want to go in there? Delicious chocolate and peanut butter confection. Oh, it's it's Reese's. Reese's Puffs, Reese's Puffs. Journal, find out who stole my book. Oh, okay. Save, yes. Before things get messed up. Oh, no, there is an autosave. Nice. File one. Back. Back we go. Down. Come on. Give it to the lady. Hey, I have nice toilet hands. You want this peanut butter choo-choo? Quit bugging me, kid. I've got a lot to do right now. What do you want? Offer the choo-choo. Wait, you're giving this to me? Wow, thank you. I haven't eaten anything all day. I guess uh, they won't mind if I go take a short break. Ha ha ha, now I can go back behind the receptionist's desk. And mess with all the computers. <laughs> I'm hacking the sensitive files. Patient survey. Yes. Which do I want to search? Upper shelf. An assortment of books and pamphlets line the shelves. Newspaper clipping is sticking out from between two of the books. Read it? Of course. 19th of March. January. Already strapped for resources. Oh, sorry, that's the burner. Hospitals are unable to accommodate new patients. Middle shelf? Yes. I get that's the, 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 the burner. Our, our water heater. Um, so... <laughs> sorry if that's rather loud. Several years worth of medical journals. Lower cabinet. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Scroll down. Scroll down. You can scroll down. Come on. Come on. Scroll down. There we go. Alright. Just gotta wait. Just gotta wait. I don't want to hit enter again because it might automatically... There we go. Folders filled with medical forms. A laminated card is clipped to the back of one of the folders. Yes, read the card. Come on. Come on, I, I just I just wanted to continue. Please, why is it why is oh why does it keep freezing? There we go. The closet passcode one seven two one. Which do you want to search? Never mind. One seven two one. That's it. That's how I get in there. Now I have various things. I can enter the old man's bathroom and enter the closet. Come on. Come on, there we go. Before I do either of those, whose room is this? Kisaboru's room. Ooh, look, you're drinking. Oh, it's another thing. Tunnel running through here that's been blocked off. Perhaps with the right tools later in the game, I can enter. Mmm, blood samples. Thermometer. Stack of notes been stapled together and attached to the inside of the folder. Page one. Page one. Page one. Based on the results of Kisaboru's brain scan, we believe the metastases to be the cause of his delirium. It is my recommendation to begin administering anti antipsychotic medicine. Please refer to the list of hallucinations and delusions. Stack. Page two. Come on. Page two. Just scroll down. Based on the results. Oh no, no. Okay. Now. I think I hit it, I think I hit enter again one too many times, so it's going to the next page. Yep. Alright. No, I did it again. Come on. Come on. Load. Please load. Please load. Okay. Down. 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 Okay. Oh thank goodness the burner stopped. I don't know how well how, how loud that shows up. Page two, come on. No! Why is it page one now? No, I hit enter before. Page two. Page two. Thank you. Thank you. Page two. Why? Now it's on page one. Page two. I hit the down button once. Come on. Page two. Enter. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Please look. There we go. 1021. 
was found climbing ladder in construction zone 5B when question replied that he intended to make a hole in the ceiling. 1028 was found in the yard digging in the mud, completely unresponsive when question appeared to be unaware of location and time. Carrying bags of dot dot dot. <gasps> Chair. Chair. What layer does this chair exist on? Oh, I guess it's this tile. Okay. Must check thing. Check. Alright, I can't check that. Oh, Kisaboru. I haven't seen you in a long time. It's good to see you walking around again. You need something? What's up? And now we wait for the enter button to respond. It seems these days are getting harder and harder to find the words. Either that or people just aren't listening. Meh. But you know, it's my time to leave this world. Oh, if it's my time to leave this world, then I'm ready to go. I just want to make sure it's the th I say the things I need to say before it's too late. Need something? Yeah, tell me about the thief. Tell me about the thief. There we go. Enter. There we are. I've been telling the nurses for a long time that someone has been sneaking around here after hours. I heard they were stealing food from the cafeteria kitchen. Which means they obviously have some way of getting into parts of the hospital that we patients don't have access to. What, were they crawling through the vents? This was before Among Us. Yeah, you'd have to be pretty small to fit through there. But no one around here, uh, here listens to me anyway. They all seem to think that I've lost my mind. Need something? Yeah, what's up? What are you drinking? Oh, does it smell that bad? I've got a new kind of tea I've been experimenting with. The nurses don't seem too thrilled about me drinking experimental things. I don't care. Folks here don't seem thrilled with a lot of things I do. Eh. I need something. Tell me about the folks around here. I'm not one for gossip. You need something. Okay, see you later. Can I enter this old man's bathroom? The door is locked. No. That magical world of wonder and intrigue I'll have to enter some other time. Blank's room. The door is locked. Oh, it's the kid who can't go to. Or is it? Well, it's locked. Has nobody checked in there? Maybe. Maybe all the food stuff is stored. Maybe there's somebody living within the dark area. That's why they stole all that food. Uh, the old man's bathroom before the passcode. Because I think the passcode will be important. Used key Tony's bathroom to unlock the door. Will I get the key to Quesaboro's bathroom? Sink. Fill with water. Must fill sink. I feel swift here. Very important. Box labeled 5C Power Supply. <gasps> Paper notice attached to the box, and there's a lever in front. Read the notice. Power Supply. Do not tamper with this device. Let's save the game. Oh, this room is red. This room is a red room. Red room. There's no mirror here, it's just electronic power. Eventually, the menu will load, and I will be allowed to save the game. As of right now, it's taking a long time to input that I hit the enter key. Uh, excuse me, the escape button. Hello? Game? Uh-oh. Hello? Hello, game? Hello? Script is hanging. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Here, can I... Let me show you. 
this happened when I was trying to pull the game up. There's something about the script of this game that's very hard to run. Properties. 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 Come on. Okay. Engine dot exe rack win. Come on. Come on. Window capture. Come on. Okay, so this is this is a thing with my computer, I guess. Oh no, well we could also Streamlabs every so often works either super well or does not work at all. Um so let's see. Oh J Night Lore is here. Oh, welcome. Oh, thank you. Thank you for the lurk. Um, so far we're having technical difficulties. Thank you for coming by, it's nice. Oh, I just noticed. Oh, yay. Uh, my computer is frozen. Hopefully the stream is still- oh, oh no. No, the, the thing showing the stream is not ticking upwards. The, the numbers are not going. I don't know if- I don't know if this is working. Oh, no. Oh, dear. Oh, gee. Oh, crime any Christmas. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Anything? Nothing is responding. Nothing is responsive. I can't scroll over anything. Oh. 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 I can, I can now select option for the window. Now, let me see if I can show you. There we go. <laughs> Done. <laughs> Script is hanging. That's the thing that's appeared on my computer. <laughs> All right, now let me actually switch to the rack one that I want. Done. <laughs> there we go. Okay, now it's all updated. There's Jay Nightlore. Yay, welcome. <laughs> oh, thank you so much. Okay, so the script is hanging. Come on, the script is hanging. I just need to hit the okay. And the game, the game's crashed. Well, that's what I have this here for. Da 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 da. <laughs> okay, well, Raccoon, <laughs> attempt number two. <laughs> okay, let me let me lower this. Luckily, I saved in the middle there, so I don't have to redo everything. Oh, I don't remember how far I got into the thing. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Thank you for the, for the lurk night, Laura. I'm sorry that this is the stream. Oh, no. Rack away. Raccoon, no. <laughs> they stole the book in the game and they stole my stream in real life. Okay. Alright, so Streamlabs is definitely having a bit of an issue here. Because this is definitely laggy. Oh. 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 Oh, excuse me. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on, Raccoon. Come on, you can load. Come on. You can do it. It just it's just a square on the bottom of the screen. It hasn't even loaded up the little like bird logo thing. Oh, oh there we go. Okay. Our Windows security threat protection. What what is the threat with loading up this game? Um, alright, I'll click on that. At least I have the game as just a, a empty square. Come on. Come on. Come on. Script is hanging. Come on, why? Why are you doing this? 
Why was why must the script be hanging? Oh no. Oh no. Oh that's not good. Oh. Did you hear that the Bob Bob's Burgers is getting a movie? Have you seen the trailer? I sound like Bob from the trailer. Oh boy. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, oh. I can't even close out. The script is hanging because it has the mouse cursor become the game thing. So I can't see where the mouse is because it, it, it disappears into the game because it has the cute little customized mouse cursor. Come on. Come on. But the the Rakuin other thing is above it, so I, I can't I can't really illustrate what this is like. I have to click the close. I have to close the option box above it without being able to see the mouse. It doesn't make sense, and that's because it doesn't. But that's what's happening here. All right. So I can't pull up Windows Security. I guess it somehow detects some. Maybe that's why it's given me a problem? What's wrong with, with Raquin? I got this through Steam. Come on. Click the, Virus and threat protection. Unauthorized access. Uh, unauthorized changes blocked. Control folder access blocked. Explorer.exe from making changes. Click to see settings. I click on to see settings, and the box just doesn't react. Okay, now it reacted. Now that I said it, it, it doesn't react. Cool. That's neat. That's nifty. Oh, great. Now my mouse cursor isn't working at all. The stream but numbers are still going. Okay, now now I can control my mouse. Oh, okay. Windows, Windows, security's slowly loading up. Here, let me put up the technical difficulties. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, no. This would be the worst time. <laughs> this would be the worst time if Laura happened to find the stream and come by to visit. Uh oh. Oh no. Come on. Come on. There we go. Folder access blocked. Let me go see what the problem is. Okay. Oh no, I hope it doesn't. When it does this. Uh oh. I hope. Don't close Streamlabs. It's going to do the doing, and then close everything, or minimizes everything else out. Okay. All right, so the stream is still running. The capture is still running. Actions. I don't know why it's doing this. Actions, allow on device. Yes. Okay, it's going to do it again. Don't crash everything. Don't crash everything. Allow Raquin, it's not a virus. Okay. I'm gonna be cool. My administrator blocked this action. I am the administrator. I didn't block this action. I'm the administrator playing, uh, not playing. Well, no, I'm, I'm playing the game. And I'm on my main computer's profile. Come on, please. Raccoon. Raccoon, just please load. Oh no. Oh, I can't even click on my my desktop stuff. Uh oh. I minimize I minimize Streamlabs to do it now. I can't pull Streamlabs up again. <sighs> so how are all you? How are all you doing? I appreciate the lurk. I don't know if anyone can hear me. Um. <laughs> oh no. This is exactly what I needed right now. You know, this is what I wanted. It's what I needed. Of course, I love it when things don't work. Oh man, that's the best. Don't you just love it? When things don't work, everything comes crashing down. 
especially when you're streaming a game of one of your heroes and nothing works during the important celebration. Come on, Raccoon. Come on, little flower bulb. Little icon on the desktop. Please work for Handington. Gonna go turn off the technical difficulties so maybe it'll work. Okay, it has to load up Steam first instead of going through Raccoon. Uh, authorizing Steam check. See, it was giving me some problems before, so I had to start and close and open the game a couple of times until I managed to get it into windowed mode instead of um, the automatic full screen mode. Um, Twitch, Twitch, Twitch load on my phone. Oh, okay. It's, it's alive. It's happening. Okay, good. Let's resume. There we go. Yes. Clump. What items do we have? We have the peanut choo-choo. Okay. All right, so this is where we last left off. Where we last left our hero, we acquired the chewiest of choo-choos. Walk, walk down. Can I check the passcode, look at the sign, look at the doorknob? Nope, okay. All right, well, since I just saved Tony's bathroom, yeah, let's see. Turn on the light. Red. Ooh, danger. Box of power supply. Pull the lever down. Power supply is on. Oh, did we do a good thing? Was it not supposed to be? Yeah, fill the sink. Was there a problem before? Yeah, hey, what are you doing with my power supplies? I wanted to get a coffee around here. What do you think you're doing in my room, kid? Get out. Figures when I was a hover, a hover, a hover. Let's see. Um, well, I guess it was good that I turned on the power supply. Let's see. Did I get the. Yeah, I got the. Did I, did I save her marbles? Hold on. Yeah, I saved the marble because that's where I got the. No, wait. Yes. No. Yeah, I saved the marble. And that's how I got the key. Yeah. Scroll mouse over. You live in the corner now, mouse. Uh, peanut choo-choo. Come on. Choo-choo for me and you, you. You can't actually access the, pe the, the key code until... There we are. Just walk down the hallway and disappear. Look at that. She she either sprinted at the speed of light or she just vaporized it. Okay. Lower cabinet. Older medical forms. Read the card. Yes. 1721. Never mind. 1721. 1721. And the shadow stops there, but I guess it's here. Door is locked. Look at the sign. Look at the knob. Knob. Electronic device called Closet 5C. Oh, I needed to turn on the power. Okay, that was good. Please enter the passcode. One. Uh, uh oh. Is it frozen? It's frozen. Okay. Seven. I hit seven. Does it become a seven automatically or? Oh no. I have to. Oh no. I'm going to have to manually click it every time, right? 
Oh no, and it freezes every time I do this. Three. Now we're gonna go on to four in a moment. It's four. Oh, what number is gonna come next? Oh my gosh. Five is coming up to the back end. There it is. It's the number five. Oh, look at that. We're at the six. We're in the home stretch. One more to seven, and then we'll be fine. Oh my gosh. This is it, folks. This is it. We're gonna get to the seventh inning stretch. We're gonna do it, and we made it. Oh. One, seven. Come on. I wonder if you can turn on the power without actually getting the choo-choo. Or if can you only look at that after you get the nurse. Hmm. I wonder if there's a secret if I do it in a different order. I want to I wanna see that. Normally I would, but I kind of want to take this game a little bit more seriously, so I'm not going to go... I'm not going to do what I normally would do, and then go back just to see if that was a thing I could do. So I'm just going to hit okay. Don't you dare go to the number two. Don't you dare... Okay, thank goodness, I hit enter. Okay. Oh, I unlocked it. Save. 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 Please save. Oh, I loaded this room. <gasps> is, uh, is a guy living in the... Living in the place? Now I can move. The tone has gotten dark. Save. Save. Let me save. Oh, it... I can scroll way easier with the mouse. Save. Save. Thank you. Okay, I saved, but now the game has crashed. The script is hanging. Mm. Escape. How? Where is my mouse? Oh, okay. Before I could scroll over and kind of find it, the script is hanging thing. But now I can't, and the whole screen is black. Can I even? Can I even escape this? Uh oh. Did it save my progress though? Oh, okay. Did it, I have? I can see my mouse again. It it blipped in the corner of the screen. Oh, okay. Now it's doing the normal thing where my whole computer gets resized because of the maximized thing. Oh dear. Uh oh. Come on. Come on, please. Please work. Oh no! Oh no! This element is too small to be... Comp oh, okay, now it's not small enough, and now it's uh, it's appeared again. The sources, all right. And Rackwin is closed. Streamlabs has moved to a different spot on my taskbar, and now the Windows Explorer is selected in a square of white, when now the white square has disappeared. Ah. <sighs> Raquin, let's try Raquin again. Why is Raquin giving me such a hard time? I tested this before and the the Pokemon game worked just fine. When I did uh, Escape Chasm. Granted, I wasn't streaming that one, but on OBS that one worked. This has been giving me problems even before I had Streamlabs up. I don't know what the problem with this game is. I don't know what's what's happening. <laughs> why why am I unable to run this five-year-old RPG Maker game? <laughs> it should be super easy to run. It shouldn't be a problem. Streamlabs must be acting up. It, it has to be something with Streamlabs. Oh, 
Oh, oh, oh. Okay. It says unauthorized changes blocked again. I thought I allowed you. And then, oh, 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 oh. oh. All right. Well, clicking on the Windows security has now pulled me out of the game. Oh, now I'm back into the other mode. Uh, okay. Resume. 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 I don't know the song well enough to sing the thing along. So I'll just do this. Oh no, did it stop streaming? This, did it interrupt and now is this a new stream? It just reset my counter. Oh. Oh, you can't even see what's happening here. Oh dear. Resume. Alright, Raquin glows. Let me let me load. Where did I see Okay, it's saved here. Yay! Alright. Let's proceed. Atten, all hospital staff urgent. Please transfer. Please begin transfer medical supplies to the second floor storage wing immediately. Someone has etched something into the edge of the bulletin board. Read it. Yes. Um. Or steer two. Rice. Rice row. Uh, oyster. That's something. The tunnel running through here has been blocked off. Get through with the right tools. Clock that's right twice a day. Cabinet. Cabinet's locked. Upper shelf. The books and pamphlets line the shelves. Newspaper clipping sticking out of this one as well. Very convenient. More newspaper clipping sticking right out of the book. The NSA said the number of... Oh. Um... I accidentally hit enter too fast on that one. That one was on me. The game didn't actually do a problem there. I just hit the button too fast. A certain of books and pamphlets. Paper clipping sticking out. Read it. Yes. Come on. 14th of March. The NSA said the number of people exposed to radiation was expected to rise. Workers in protective clothing scanned people arriving at the evacuation centers for radioactive exposure. Ooh. Middle shelf. Come on now. I like how the text boxes look like um, chalkboards. One more. Come on. Middle shelf. Middle shelf, middle shelf. Hey, it's the middle shelf, middle shelf. Several years worth of medical journals. Lower cabinet. I like that it's it, it's based off... The, they're both shelves and the bottom is the cabinet, just like the way it is on the sprite. That's nice attention to detail there. Lower cabinet. Come on. Come on, lower cabinet. Come on. Oh, the lower cabinet has a script hanging. Rack one script is hanging. What script? What script is hanging? What does that mean? Okay, well, at least it exited me out of the game faster that time. That's cool. I just ran Malware Bytes yesterday, and today I have done nothing but try to stream. There can't be a virus. Please. Why? Why do you do this game? Why, Streamlabs, why must you do this? Okay. I really wanted to do more of this stream. I really wanted to play more. I don't think we can. It's been giving me way too many problems today. My computer had some problems just loading up. Granted, I was loading it up because I had both Streamlabs and Raquin in the background all ready for me to be able to start up today. I was just like, yep, I'll do it. 
Brass been running slow all day. Is there some other update for Streamlabs that it's trying to download? I have no idea what's happening. Um, I guess I will just end the stream. We didn't get too big of a turnout, which is a